is so bad. What? What is my fingers are sticky today? Hey guys, Nevo and I are back. So Nevo's been going at killing Hell's Envoy without me. So yeah. basically, oh, Nevo and I are trying to get our you know skill back up. Hey, assassin pants, I needed that. Yeah, that's why. That's why I said nice. That's awesome. Okay, so uh, we are gonna go do Helheim Rift and see if we can't get into trouble. Basically, Nevo and I are a duo, which is not that, I mean, Frostborn doesn't really have a lot of great things for uh, duos, but we're just getting into trouble together. That's what we do. And uh, we need to do Hell's Envoy because we need a little bit more gear. We've been using a lot of gear to, um, to basically, we just need content. And sometimes if there's, if the game isn't giving you, you know, enough PVP and stuff, you have to do stupid things to be able to get content. And that's what we've been doing. So, I mean, it's basically we're doing, uh, it's like, it's like giveaways, uh, <laughs> except, you know, they have to earn it. So, okay, I'm going to just grab, so we're going to Helheim, right? Yeah, Helheim. Okay, do you have some more bandages? Because I ran out again. Yes. Yeah, I got lots of bandages, and I and I didn't even craft any. I just had them in my base. So, hopefully, we don't run into a team that's as um, good at avoiding your taunts as as the last episode. Oh those, yeah. Those guys were, dude. You look so. They bullied so... me in like one minute. They bullied me four times. <laughs> it's un it's it was insane. That was so yeah. frustrating. I mean, but we're new. We're new to duo. So, are you on the computer? Yeah, I am. Yeah, you look so like choppy. <laughs> yeah, when you're I running. do. <laughs> I don't think there's anyone. I know. I'm I'm, I'm seeing that. It's disappointing. Maybe do you want to go into the center here? I doubt we'll find people there, but but at least we'll open this chest. <laughs> Yeah, I think they should have made the chest a bit better. They know? did make them a little better. They they have like uh, seals and and marks in them and now sometimes. That's oh, they nice. do. Yeah. Oh. They they I forget when they they did it, but they they made them significantly better than they were when they first when it first came out. Oh, nice. I never opened chests. Cause... Yeah, because when they first came out with Helheim Rift, you're like, this is just a red zone chest. Yeah. Exactly. Wow, nobody. Nobody nowhere. I have a axe. Yeah, go get a pickaxe. Okay, I'll, I'll go. I'll chop maple while I wait for you. Don't die. <laughs> I'll do my best. Here, I'll, uh, I'll use my favorite getaway combo. Oh no. This is not what I meant to do. Alright, killed the wolf. Actually, I like this better. But I need to get in the habit of putting these where... Uh, I just... I need to... I just don't have time to get as good as at, at this game as I want to be. Uh, do you want me to bring another X for you? I mean a pick X? Or no. even X? Or, I mean, you might as well bring two for or Calcum if you want to get some. Okay. Does your X have enough durability for... All the maple, yeah. Okay. Okay, I got three pickaxes on me. You know what? I just had an idea that I think think is brilliant. What do you think about this, Nevo? I think that the devs should change the Tomb of Ash. Like, everything's the same, except they move it, the Tomb of Ash, over into Helheim Rift. It's the Tomb of Helheim Rift. And oh. you never, it's always in Helheim Rift, but it's never in um, in the Red Zone anymore. And uh, and so you can know it's there, you you always know how to get it, and you so you get the keys, and you can just be like, yeah, we're going to go to Helheim Rift, we're going to go to the Tomb of Ash. And, uh, and that way, people that go to, you know, Helheim Rift, they might be like, oh, let's go check. But then they're like, well, let's go check the Tomb of Ash, see if anyone's trying to do it. And then they obviously need to make the loot better in it. Yeah, this sounds a very good idea. But what I was thinking is maybe because people are coming to Helheim mainly to farm. Some of them are obviously coming to PvP. Uh -huh. But uh, they should make the Tomb of Ash like an event. 
like Al Helheim or Dinstrich or Druids. Well, basically, like, they would be making it. They would make Helheim Rift even. I mean, Helheim Rift is already awesome, right? Because a lot of people come to PvP. But the whole point of the Tomb of Ash is that it would be PvP. I mean, it would be awesome if it was PvP. So I really like that idea. I th I think that that would be. It would be very little work for them. I think. Someone. Oh, there's someone. Nice. Wow. I think he's just here to farm, but he's he's so quick. <laughs> I think he's mounted or something, cause he just flew away. Just flew he's away. Here. Yeah. Is he running still? Yeah, I think he's mounted. All right. Oh, there's. Oh no no no. There. It's it's a clan called Warhammer. <laughs> oh, he's a fanatic. Yeah, Tio. <laughs> Wait. There was one more guy here. Should we fight him? Yeah, I mean... Uh, uh, there's This guy has a protector spear. I think it's just to get him in the zone. I don't know. <laughs> I don't mind killing him, but... I don't. I, I think it's only to get in the zone. Yeah. But he might have some cuppers. Wait, I know Tio. I think... Oh, Tio. He had Warhammer in his Oh my clan. gosh, why does it keep doing this? <laughs> my autocorrect. I hate... Autocorrect? Autocorrect should have something like where you do something twice, it says, hey, why would I do this two times in a row? Let's not <laughs> autocorrect it again. I don't know. On my phone, I disabled autocorrector because it's pretty annoying. Man, we got quite a bit of stuff from Tio. Nice. Maybe he comes back. Yeah, I'll give him some of his stuff back if he comes back. Yeah. There's someone over here. Nevo, do you have a horse yet? <laughs> no, I don't. I don't even have the stable. <laughs> oh my gosh, Nevo, we gotta get you a stable. Yeah, we will. You're never gonna catch up with this guy if he's on horse. I know. I mean, maybe if I use my speed push. Did oh, you gather bandages yet? Yes, I guess. You're so fast. <laughs> oh, someone spawned. Yeah, someone spawned right here. Is that Tio? Yes. Yeah, Tio! Why, his name is the he's the Warhammer uh, clan. Yeah. <laughs> this name is pretty popular in Romania. He might T. be o? Romanian. Yeah. Are you the T.O. that has talked to me on Discord question mark? You sent me some memes, right? Question mark? <laughs> I told you. Yeah, that's crazy. So, please talk to developers to remove the troll. I actually like the troll. That's not the issue. I, I the, We have much bigger issues than the troll, okay? The troll is a little weird. I like the troll because it brings me back good memories to Last Day on Earth, but uh, I do think the troll is dumb for Frostborn, at least at some level. Maybe they should make it more worth killing it, or I don't know, something to change the troll. I get it. I, I'm not saying we, it's awesome, but on the level of, of things that the devs need to change, um, trolls like right here and like, you know, district level or classes, district levels and pay to win horses are like through the roof. Okay. So, you know, yes, troll, maybe they should tweak it, but we've got much bigger problems in Frostborn. Uh, if they don't do something, this game um, could die before it got started. And that would really be sad, but especially because I put about two years planning uh, into this moment for Frostborn to explode and then the devs added all of this stuff that's hurting it. So <sighs> that was my, my bad strategy. As they say, don't put all your eggs in one basket. I put too many eggs in Frostborn. Um, I mean, it's been okay, you know, but it, it could have been so much more. Hopefully it still will be. You know, uh, the devs have listened to us in the past. They definitely don't seem like they're listening to us right now. Uh, really, ever since the pay to win horses came out, it just has kind of felt like they stopped listening to us, but that was only one update. It just It's just been radio silence. So I'm really hoping that the next update, the next real update, obviously they've come, with, they're trying to fix bugs and stuff, which is good, but hopefully the next real update will have actual significant changes so um they should okay. do a reward system for uh people rating if they yeah don't yeah a reward trust. system for rating all right with success kid one only forza only have four mods this is epics epic I gamer don't moment anything from that. i don't understand <laughs> it either with success kid with success kid and one with forza only have four mods does anyone understand what that means 
Oh, oh son, the sons of Rift are here. Let's get out of here, Nebo. What if there was a four-man team? We were hoping for that. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, let's go to Druid. Oh, yeah. We're going, we're going to Druids. Maybe we should name this episode The Crazy Adventures of Fuerza and Nevo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's a nice story. Yeah. Exploring the world for, for the unknown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to Druids. Me too. Okay, I've entered. Alright, I'm entering. Soup up. Okay, do you wanna go yeah. straight to the middle or um, the edges? So I'm gonna put some traps in this bush so we can come back. There's a guy. I see it. So if we know. if uh, anything goes wrong, Nevo, let's we just run here. let's run back to this bush. Okay. And uh Oh, there's someone here, I think. I heard the... Stuff. Yeah, there's someone. Let's go. Uh, okay. I taunted him. He seemed blue here. Nice. Oh, he's 6 HP. Oh, oh he wow, he good. went... <laughs> that was so bad. What? What is my fingers are sticky today? <laughs> he bullied me right near his corners. <laughs> Wow, that's some good stuff. Stuff. Do we go back to the bush or do we stay here? I'm gonna put a trap right here. We I'm can go back to the bush if we need to, but... Okay, I'll see if there's anyone here. That guy was Archmage. He was Archmage, that's why it took so long for us to kill him, that makes sense. Yeah, after he got that, that shield, it was... Right here, pretty. right here, right here, right here. Oh, I'm lagging. Nice! The Adventures of Nevo and Fuerza! <laughs> <laughs> and now for a team comes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. There's another guy in the zone. Yeah, I know. Alright, you wanna go? Go to the chest. Okay. There's someone here in this bush. Okay. I mean, they'll probably attack you once it opens, right? Nice. <laughs> wow, this guy just bought a uh, mage set. Okay, I already opened the stuff. Here, you can... Alright. Oh, there's some purple gear in it. Yeah. That's crazy. Dude, Nevo, we just dominated a our first druids as a duo. Yeah, we're starting to get pro at this. <laughs> yeah, we're getting pro or we're getting lucky. One of the two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, I kind of want to stick around and see if anyone else comes, but also I got an entire uh, inventory full of gear. <laughs> no, you can go and drop it off. I'm going to stay in the zone. Okay. your maple tree grew back <laughs> let me check I'm sure it did it's been a few days yeah all right drop in oh, the there's stuff, someone huh? in the zone oh he's naked what is he saying no he's he's just naked go with the horse in the zone well we got a ton of bandages from that experience oh nice bandages are always good yeah especially especially for us we love to lose our bandages yeah. We love to lose gear. <laughs> <laughs> Without Berry Dealer, I don't know who's going to repair my items. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> Berry Dealer was online every day, and that's how we kept repairing our items. Mm -hmm. Alright, so no one else is in there? Uh, he was in the zone, I don't know. He's still in the zone. Because he had the horse and I couldn't follow. We gotta get you a horse, Nevo. You're. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'll trade for some uh, gold pendants. An open a gold why don't, cache. Why don't you? Uh, I mean, why don't you just buy one? You 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 buy a lot of stuff. Wait, can I can I buy it? You can buy a horse, yes. Yes, but I don't have the stable. No, you don't. You can buy it without it. Whoa, what is this? Oh, really? A giant's pack. That's interesting. Oh, new pack. Um. And there's level three bag in it. With one star. I mean, if you have a thousand coins, uh, actually, you should wait till the next update. I think they're gonna make the horse cheaper. I hope to make the horse cheaper. Yeah, hopefully. 
But the next time there's a sale for horses, you just buy a, you just buy them. You don't have to have a stable. Yeah, I think I'm gonna buy. So, oh, wait, so you don't need a stable for them? No, you don't need a stable. The stable's just to get them for free, which oh. is kind of worthless. It's every three days. Okay, I thought you need the stable to keep them in the stable. No, no, they wouldn't make it that realistic. I mean, that's what they did on Les Dinner with the dog, so yeah, that's yeah. why I saw. That makes sense. Because I played a lot of Les Dinner. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Uh, there's a lot of people playing this game that are what I would call last day on earth refugees. They, <laughs> yeah. they, they got jaded by last day on earth. They came to Frostworm because it was what we wanted in last day on earth, and now we're all getting getting hurt again. <laughs> and maybe yeah. not. I really do hope that the devs change it. I mean, the game's still true multiplayer, a lot of fun. It just, I don't know what they're doing. I'm not sure. What I think doing. the fate of Frostborn is going to be on the next update. If they do it... Then the Jotunheim update, I agree. I think that the Jotunheim update, if they do a really good job, then I think people will come back. Um, but if if it sucks, if it's like last day in Earth, uh, you know, swamp update, <laughs> then I'll yeah. be like, yeah, this is dumb. So Hopefully okay. you don't need a level 4 horse to get the Jotunheim. <laughs> I know. Because that, that will be... <laughs> yeah, it'll... It'll just piss people off even more. All right, guys. Well, that was it for the adventures of Nevo and Fuerza. And uh, we actually came out pretty good on this one. We got stuff from uh, Helheim Rift and we got stuff from Druids. We, we kind of got, you know, it wasn't amazing stuff, but it was it was good and we didn't lose anything. So honestly, for us as a duo, this, this, this is the best episode we've had so far. We've, we've lost the least amount of gear uh, out of any of our episodes and we even gained some. So uh, hopefully we'll just keep getting better. Like I said, there are two people that are coming that are going to join us soon. I'm not going to tell you who they are and uh, we're going to do a bunch of episodes with them. All right, guys. See you next time.